Hello, I'm your protector, Alpha Protector X. Welcome to episode three of cheating in FTL. Last time, we talked about Zoltans and how they sucked, and pretty much that, that's all that happened. How we needed Zoltans, and then, yep, and basically we're killing ships and trying to get the five to get the achievement while cheating. Ha ha, because we're awesome, you know. I don't cheat in this game. I hardly cheat. It just seemed like something fun we could do. Just for, you know, some something fun for the channel. If you guys want me to show you how to cheat in this game, I can perfectly show you using Cheat Engine. And this guy is useless to us. So I'm going, mm. This guy is completely useless to us. We're gonna go to this stress beacon. Hopefully we don't have to really do anything to help. In any way, which way, shape, or form. Whatever, give them fuel. It was useless because we have unlimited scrap. Having unlimited scrap, you know, we could just have one to kill the ship slightly now. Now we're gonna come over here. If there's a store, we're gonna jump to the store, or else we're just gonna jump back. Energy homeworlds usually have a lot of stores. That's what I've noticed. No, heck no. We don't want none of that. Alright, it's ultimate. We're basically staying in the green civilian sectors because we do not have the power to be fighting anything at this point. We don't want to fight anything. We don't want to get in confrontations with anything, basically. We just want to get out through these sectors as fast as possible. Because. Because we do not have the stuff to be fighting these people. We don't. I'm just going to be straight up, we don't have anything to fight these people with. Well, I'm, tr I'm really trying to see what, what I can do with this pike beam here. How effective I can I make it? Alright, we'll do that. Whatever. It'll hit that. It's about as much as we can do to the ship currently. And we're gonna move on. Alright, Iron Blast just been shot. And here comes a missile. The missile shouldn't be able to penetrate our shields. Our super duper shields. Awesomeness. And just to make sure they can't mess with us, we're gonna do that. Then we're gonna. Come on, let, it, let me use it. Can I like go down one and then. Oh yeah. We got flak, guys. We got extra shields and flak. Fear us. Fear us all. Oh, sweet jeez. We just dominated this thing. Oh, God. Oh, my God. We dominated this thing. Flak, obviously, gonna go in the middle of the ship because it gives us more of a range of hitting. Oh. Fleck is very very inaccurate. I told you guys. It sucks. A whole lot. But it is very effective at taking out shields. Which is why I love Flack. If you if you get basically get Flack throughout the game, get as many of the Flack as possible for the final boss battle, because if you can get like six if you can get like two Flack machines that they, it'll just wreck their shields and you can completely and utterly destroy them. All you need to really worry about is getting your shields up and just auto fire and you win. It's base, it's that simple. The flak is overpowered. Flak OP, please no, you know. Oh, sweet Jesus. Intruders on board. The Mantis outcast sometimes in the mistake of taking his ultimate for an easy gain. The scout moves to attack while boarding party beams aboard a nearby transport. You must have a super shield bypass unit. Boarders are on board. Okay, we're gonna do this. That that's exactly what we're gonna do. We're gonna do that. And then we're gonna laugh at them for making us have flak, get extra shields up, get a mind control, because why the heck not? 
Mind control this guy. Get two ion blasts on their weapons. It's gonna hit their shields, but whatever. And now this is what we're gonna do. Because there's time to escape because there's no oxygen. Now here's the problem. There's gonna be no oxygen in this room. Oh no, really? I'm gonna show you just how destructive the flat can be. Ready guys? This is how destructive flat can be if you're taking out shields, and this is why I love the weapon. Before you get to see it, we gotta activate all of our other weapons. Bam, watch this. Flak just took out the entire freaking thing. Flak just took out all those shields. And we've practically won this. Because of Flak. We killed the intruders. Again, ion blasting everything, hoping they hit the shields, and then the Flak. And obviously it's like it shields, but flak can be pretty devastating. As you can see, it hits, it takes out all, it works, you know, it works. Alright, moving on. We have two more ion blasts. Ooh. Oh, we gotta wait. Here's our chance to strike. One hull damage we basically have beat one horribly. Alright, we got back DNA bank, but we already have it. <laughs> we already have it. Uh, okay. This achievement is being tougher than I thought. It is coming to oh my god, dual story back to back. Could this be our chance to get Zoltans? Maybe. Ooh. Basically, you just got. Yes, we got another Zoltan. Oh, you guys don't even know how awesome that is. We got one more Zoltan. Guess what? We put him in weapons. We got our flag. It is that simple. Bam. Our entire thing. It's nearly being powered by Zoltans. <laughs> we, we are nearly being powered by Zoltans. Two flak. We got our flak. And I'm pretty happy. If we can get another Zoltan, that'd be great. I mean, we'll put him somewhere on the ship. We'll probably put him in cloaking, mind control, hacking. Because we can't fit any more in our weapons. <laughs> Nebulas because nebulas have ion fields, ion fields remove our weapons. Oh. Dang. Okay. So this thing is basically going to send an ion blast every few seconds and it's going to mess up your ship's potential. Which is going to suck hardcore. So immediately, what, see, we don't have really the weaponry to fight two shields, three shields, four shields even. We don't have enough power to do any of this. So what we are really forced to do is sit on our hands and wait. Iron Pulse Imminent. Iron Pulse Imminent. What's it gonna mess up? Okay, what did it send? What's it gonna mess up? What's it messing up? It messed up him! It didn't mess up me! It's because I have super shields? That can't be. Really? As you guys can tell, I am very, very confused. Because, really, I don't know what the heck just happened. I, I was supposed to receive Ion Pulse. An Ion Pulse, but I guess I didn't because I have the Super Shields. I'm guessing. I'm not too positive on it. Let's see, another Ion Pulse. It took away the last of our super shield. Oh, okay, so it's taking our super shield. So we have to. Next one, it's gonna mess it us up. So, 